need to go all the way forward to get off the forward stairs which is the blue carpet we just pass in the midship stairwell which is the red carpet just passing past the uh, shopping area blue staircase down to deck three Thank you. He's my junior. Right, so let's go see if we can get a cab over here. Our cab drivers brought us up here, a tiny little road that brings you up to this absolutely amazing view. It's breathtaking. Yes. That's yes. all the Dubrovnik old city and the city walls just down here. Stunning. And the weather's beautiful as well, so it's lovely and clear. You've got the sun reflecting off the roofs and it looks unbelievable. So Sanal, our taxi driver, has just dropped us off here. It was really good, wasn't it? Well worth doing. He took us on a little tour, didn't yeah, he? Yeah, it was fantastic. Yeah. Really nice guy. And he's uh, given us a restaurant recommendation as well. A little uh, restaurant with a terrace just there. So we might try that on our way back out. But we're going to go in. So we'll see you in there. Well, it's nice and cool in the shade. Let's get ahead of the tour. Especially when it reflects off these uh, buildings, you get really warm, don't you, really quickly. But it's lovely in this shaded bit. Yeah, there are quite a few people, but it's not rammed, is it? It's not like no, it's not too bad, claustrophobic. Really. Looks like there's lots of nice places to get tea and coffee. So we've just got our tickets, and now we're walking up the steep stairs to get onto the wall, up on top of the wall, and it is pretty steep and all.
amazing, isn't it? <laughs> I'm nearly full circle. Yeah, I think this is where we came in, isn't it? It's down here somewhere. Yeah. That street down there. Is that right? I think, in fact, it might have even been these stairs. What do you reckon? I reckon it is. Yes, I think it is. Yeah, yeah. otherwise, yeah. yeah. Go down these stairs, otherwise we're gonna end up doing a, another lap. <laughs> I'm not sure we want to do another lap. It was fantastic though, wasn't it? But it's quite hot. Yeah. I just need a drink, really. But yeah, what an amazing experience walking around that wall is. to Dolce Vita on one of the little side streets. It was recommended as the best ice cream place within the old city. So, so we thought we'd give it a go. There are some really nice seats outside in a little alleyway that you walk up to get into the into the uh, ice cream parlor. Uh, really nice little seating area, but as you can imagine, it's lovely weather and everyone is sat outside. So. But it's not too bad in here. Ice cream has arrived, my tiramisu ice cream, and you've gone for? Vanilla cream cherry. Wow, pancakes. pancakes. Yummo. That was lovely. That was very nice. Needed that little break, little water break, some nice ice cream to cool down. Lovely. They thought in one you need. Why try to fight it? Get somebody in the face. Little pussy cat. That's awesome. Got a little bit of live music going on in that little. Uh, Restaurant there. Awesome. They're really good, aren't they, actually? They really are really good. This is where all the boat tours are going out from, obviously. Oh, it's actually quite peaceful when you walk out of the city itself, isn't it? Yeah. This is where we came in. But yeah, it was good fun, that wall. And there are, there are actually various entrances up onto the wall, not just the one we did. So that's where we just were, just down there. That's where all the boat trips are obviously going in and out of. But yes, absolutely stunning. Look at the water, look how clear it is. And there's even a nice little beach. You see the old city here behind me? We've just come out, walk around, and then you've got some steps that come down onto the little beach if you wanted to sit on the beach for a bit. A little restaurant there. It's really, really lovely.
What a lovely little spot this is. Yeah, I think we're going to move from here because it is roasting hot. And we're back in our cabin. That was funny. We had the same taxi driver back as uh, as we had going out. That's better. I feel much, much better after that shower. He obviously gave us new towels because they were both folded up on that little shelf. Bit. So we have new, new towels today. We've got an awesome view of the bridge actually, haven't we, from here? have just turned up as a late afternoon into the evening uh, tuk tuk tour is one of the excursions that was available i think it was a 4 p.m start Oceania ship that was berthed behind us there. <laughs> we're off out for dinner. Uh, we're going to go and get a drink first, down in the lounge possibly, and then the Italian. Chink. Cheers. So we're back in Vista, which is the Italian part of the main dining room. We've got some nice olives with a bit of olive oil and balsamic. This is often where we will sit at breakfast, all the way aft. But the big windows there behind us, really lovely table, eh? So I've decided to go for another red wine. I had a red wine in the lounge. I think it's a Merlot on Morella, the house red. You've got it is tonight, white, I think you? they change it. So you've gone for the calamari as well? Yeah, God, I love calamari. Delicious. I do remember having the calamari on Discovery a few years ago and uh, remember it being very nice. That's really good, yeah. Some people don't like it, do they? Because it, it's a little bit rubbery. Is it rubbery? Not to me, I like it, I love it. So this cheese take long, as long as they clean properly and they put in the nice temperature of the fridge. Yeah. Yeah, because sometimes we are using it, right? If we left some, if we left some sauce in here, it's going to have some mold. Sure, so yeah. So, so how, long, how long would the whole cheese last? This one, two months. Really? Oh, really? Wow, two months. Okay. Well, it long, uh, like what I said before, it lasts long. Yeah, as yeah. As long as you put in the right temperature of the fridge and you clean it properly. Of yeah, course, so yeah. Some yeah. Chili picks? yeah, lovely, thank you. This will do? Yeah, perfect. There you go, how about some parsley? Yes, that'd be lovely. There you go. And extra parmesan cheese? Uh, no, I think that's no. enough. <laughs> 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 there you go. That's <laughs> lovely, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. You're going to finish that before I've even started mine. It is quite tasty, actually. <laughs> it is quite tasty. I'm not doing a very good job of this. Oh my god. <laughs> that is amazing. The cheesiness of this is absolutely amazing. Yeah, it's really, really lovely. 
I'm going to go for the affogato and vanilla ice cream with a shot of espresso because I had that for the first time on Discovery. Really enjoyed it. So I'm going to go for that. What did you say you were going to go for? I don't know either the old pastry tart with a sweet lemon filling or the bread and butter pudding with vanilla ice cream. I don't know. I bet, bet the bread and butter pudding would be nice. Yeah, maybe I'll try that. Your bread and butter pudding looks amazing. <laughs> Go for it, you can eat it now if you want. And I've taken the cust- shots I need to. And it comes with custard as well. Oh yeah, it's good. Custard. Yeah, it really is good. Actually, it's quite nice sitting here with a drink. It's funny, isn't it? On P&O, they wouldn't actually allow you to bring drinks in. Whereas on Morella, they've actually got drinks there waiting for you for when you come oh, in. Oh no, they used to serve them though, didn't they? When they you did, but, the last, but they kind of stopped. The last couple of cruises we've been on, they wouldn't allow you to bring drinks in no. from elsewhere. I don't know whether they've stopped that completely now, whether yeah, they'll start that again. You know. Well, to be fair, we were mask wearing in the theatre it's, as well, well whereas, it, whereas exactly, there's no mask yeah. wearing on the ship at all on uh, Morella, so. Welcome to the once infamous Palais d'Ombre, the Palace of Shadow. What lurks within those shadows, I hear you ask? Only the most exquisite, the most extraordinary, the most beautiful displays of performance art, the likes of which cannot be found elsewhere, on any land or sea. We are glad you are here to witness our revival. Brace yourselves, folks, for out of those shadows, we give you Starting to sail away. I'm just going to film this and uh, I'll see you at breakfast in Kotor, Montenegro, in the morning. Thanks for watching. Mm-hmm.